Hey guys, it's Pelly. I hope you're having a great day. Welcome to my channel where we talk about fashion. In this video, we will discuss what happened to some of the iconic Victoria's Secret angels. Grab a snack and get comfortable. This will be a two-part series. This video is about the original 90s angel and part two will be about the 2000 angels. Before we begin, let's talk about the brand. This famous or infamous American lingerie retailer was founded in 1977 by Roy and Gay Raymond. The couple later sold the company to Leslie Waxner, a billionaire businessman who quickly grew the company into the largest lingerie retailer in the United States by the 1990s. The first Victoria's Secret fashion show was held in 1995. It wouldn't be broadcast on network television until 2001. By featuring beautiful models and A-list celebrities, the fashion show was a major marketing tool that not only helped it sell, but made it a part of pop culture history. Victoria's Secret's catalog? Yeah, it's in the bathroom with Junior. Hey, Charlie, you want to go with me to the Victoria's Secret? Yes. Cardio workout in. <laughs> At least I got the mail. Looking for something in particular? Oh, 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 oh. Tyra, can I ask you a question? Is it still called underwear, even though you're not wearing it under anything? Yeah, it is. Just a question. You're all uh, Victoria's Secret supermodels. What are you doing in our dressing room? <laughs> the Victoria's Secret Angel was introduced earlier in their catalog before going mainstream, with the Angel Collection TV commercial that featured the first five original angels. Being a VS model is different from being a VS Angel. A VS Angel is the face of the brand and they are contracted spokesmodel with greater responsibilities. At the heart of Victoria's Secret Fashion Show, where it garnered millions of viewers, being a model for the show could launch a model's career and being an angel could catapult a model to supermodel status. The brand has had several controversies, from the perfect body campaign to cultural appropriation, with ongoing criticism, their sale and viewers started to decline, and soon the annual fashion show was canceled in 2018. So, what happened to the original angels? Let's find out. Secret introduces angels. We're not those kind of angels. I try to be an angel. Well, if she's an angel, then I'm Don't a... Don't say it, Karen. Angel, our sheerest, shiniest, most colorful bras and panties ever. I told you never to call me here. <laughs> My cloud says who? <laughs> Good angels go to heaven. Victoria's Secret angels go everywhere. Angels only at Victoria's Secret. Helena Christensen. Born in Copenhagen, Denmark, she was meant to be a model. She began modeling at age 9 and at 17, she won the Miss Universe Denmark in 1986. In the 1990s, she received a supermodel title as she became one of the most popular models during that time, starring in music videos, many fashion campaigns, and worked for many designers. She was a VS Angel from 1996 to 1998, walking in a total of two fashion shows. Christians then ventured to many different fields, such as acting, and is the co-founder of Nylon Magazine. She also launched several clothing lines and is an accomplished photographer, loved being in front of the camera and behind the camera. As for her personal life, she has one son with actor Norman Reedus. Most recently in 2020, Christensen was featured in Victoria's Secret newest campaign where they set out to represent diversity. She was a part of the Christian Cohen X Lil Nas X 2021 collection. If you take a look at her Instagram, Helena Christensen is timeless. She still several looks, poses, and so much more. Karen Mulder. This Dutch model started modeling at age 15 after a friend took some photos of her and sent them to Elite without her knowledge. She was later signed to Elite Paris where her career skyrocketed. Mulder appeared on many different covers of Vogue and model for designers like Versace and Valentino. She was ranked top 10 best paid model in the world for many years in the 90s. She was a VS Angel from 1996 to 2000, walking in a total of five fashion shows. She retired in 2000 and she dabbled both in acting and singing. In 2001, Mulder claimed on a talk show that various people of high rank have forced themselves on her, including top executive at Elite Model and Prince Albert of Monaco. Footage was never released and she issued an apology to Prince Albert of Monaco. 
She suffered from chronic depression and later came forward again with her allegation, but when that was published, her sister took her to a psychiatric hospital where she stayed for five months. Her time in the hospital was reportedly paid for by a lead model president who later got caught by BBC on hidden camera, bribing a 15-year-old girl and bragging about model he would sleep with. In 2002, Mulder was found passed out on the floor of her friend's apartment. She reportedly overdosed on sleeping pill and went into a coma. She awoke from a coma the next day, surrounded by her family. She would give birth to a daughter named Anna in 2006. In 2016, she attended Paris Fashion Week. She doesn't have any public social media and managed to stay out of the limelight. Daniela Pistova. This Czech model was born on October 14, 1970. At age 19, she was discovered at a theater in Prague by Medicine Modeling Agency. Her career took off after moving to New York City, appearing on the cover of Elle magazine, Marie Claire, and so much more. She was the VS Angel from 1997 to 2001, walking a total of four shows. For her personal life, she has three children. She attended the 2018 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show and is featured in the 2020 campaign. She has been modeling for a total of three decades, still being booked and still very successful. She has a very active Instagram page where she shares her life. She turned 50 recently and looked absolutely flawless. Her timeless beauty, career, and personality are inspiring. Stephanie Seymour Born in San Diego, California, Seymour began modeling at age 15, modeling for local newspaper and department stores. By the 1990s, her career skyrocketed and she appeared on countless covers of major magazines such as Vogue. She was given supermodel status and became one of the most famous models of that time. While she was a supermodel, she dated Axel Rose from the band Guns N' Roses. She appeared in two music videos for the band. The couple were engaged until February 1993. Later that year in August, she would get sued by her ex claiming she assaulted him and stole jewelry worth more than $100,000. She would counter Sue claiming he was physically abusive and team up with his ex-wife to testify that she was also abused by him. The lawsuit was eventually settled. She started walking for the VS Fashion Show in 1995, became an official angel from 1997 to 2000, walking a total of six shows. In 1997, she published Beauty Secret for Dummies. She dabbled in acting, guest star in Law and Order. She is married to billionaire Peter Bryant. They have three children together. She isn't always active on social media, posting updates or throwback pics from time to time. Tyra Banks. She was teased for her look at a young age, but will officially begin modeling at age 15. After being rejected by several agencies, she was later signed to Elite Model Management. She quickly received the supermodel status, booking 25 shows during her first runway season. She appeared in many editorial and campaign and became the first woman of African American descent to be featured on the cover of GQ and Sport Illustrated Swimsuit Issue. Even in the earlier stages of her career, she starred in many music videos and did some acting for TV shows and movies. In 1983, she became a cover girl. In 1997, she became a VS Angel until 2005, walking a total of 10 shows. In 2005, she publicly retired as a professional model to focus on her production company, where she would go on to receive an Emmy for her talk show. She created the famous American Next Top Model that's now part of the global Next Top Model franchise. But recently, Top Model has been criticized and Tyra has since apologized. She had a starring role on Life Size 2. She also hosted American Got Talent and now in 2020 is hosting Dancing with the Stars. She has a son. She is not only a model, she is an actress, a host, an author, producer, a very accomplished woman, and overall a passionate entertainer. Tyra Bing has remained in the headlines since she debuted on the runway. She is active on all social media with a huge following. So this is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy or find this video informative, give it a like. And if you love fashion, please subscribe. Do you have a favorite VS Angel? Don't forget to comment your favorites below. Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you in part two. Bye.